Hey, what's up YouTube? Uh, Nocturnal Productions here, and I'm here to do a, a double um, package unboxing. So I just received my mask from, move the camera a little bit back. Uh, I just received my mask from Jeff Depp over at Depp Studios. And I actually ordered four masks. I'm not sure if uh, there's only two masks, you know, in each package, or there's two and two in both of these packages, I'm not too sure. But I do remember I ordered the Night Terror, I think it was a 3.0 mask. And then I ordered the Dead as Hell mask. I ordered the, I think it was called the Baby Face mask. And I also ordered, I can't remember, I'm gonna tell my head the other one, but those three I remember. Oh, uh, the Hockey Mask Zombie was another one that I ordered. Um, so I'm not sure if all four of them are here, but we're just about to find out. Let's get this started. You can already smell the latex. Put the box down here. Okay, looks like there's one mask in each package. And this is the dead as hell mask. And I cut them out of the bag right here. So yeah, there he is. Dead as hell. This one looks really, really cool. Um, in my personal opinion, I just feel like Jeff Death makes the best zombie masks of all time. I don't collect too many zombie masks from other artists, but um, Jeff Death, he's by far my favorite zombie maker out there. So there it goes, the dead as hell. And let's see what's in this one. This one's pretty lightweight. Find out what's in here. Oh, oh sweet. Okay, wasn't expecting this. This is the baby face mask. Pretty cool. Get it out of the bag. Oh, oh super, super cool. Oh, I love this. I wasn't expecting this, the baby face mask. It's like, it's actually, it's all, it's all pink. And I, I really like pink. I think it's a pretty cool color. Wow, it actually looks really good on him. I'm, I don't know if you, uh, I'll put a link in the description uh, where you guys can see the original mask. On the website, it looks like it has like uh, tannish skin with a white, you know, uh, face mask. But this is like all pink and it's actually visually pleasing if you see it in person. This is super cool. This one's a really ple pleasant surprise because I really was not expecting this color. But uh, yeah guys, uh, there you have it, uh, both masks. I will do individual reviews on these pretty soon. You guys can check these out. I'll have this video and the others uploaded hopefully by the end of this week. But yeah, there you guys have it. The baby face mask and the does hell mask. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch you guys next time. All right guys, I'm back. So I wanted to uh, showcase like, I guess a new method on how I'll like be reviewing my mask. If I do get like a double mask unboxing, I'll be sure to uh, show them both off. And um, I'm gonna review them um, together in one solid video. So uh, yeah, um, over here we have the baby face mask. This one I believe came around, I wanna say either 2013, 2014, around there. Um, originally the mask, it was uh, released as a face mask. And then Jeff would later on make a full head version, which is the one that you're seeing right now. But yeah, really, really beautiful mask. Um, 
looks a lot better in person. Um, the mask actually came off very pinkish. I think this would be a really cool mask to like show off like for Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Because it has these like really cool looking pinks. But yeah, it's they're just they're very, very nice. But um, show you guys up close. Has some really awesome detail. He's got cracks all over the face right here. The bottom lip. I, I love it whenever Jeff uh, shows like um, cracks on his mask. It just shows like a lot more depth to the menace. And then uh, this mask also has an elastic strap on the bottom. Not on the bottom, on the back of the head. But yeah, it's really cool. You can see the vein work on the back of the head as well. It's super, super phenomenal. More vein work right here. I didn't, I didn't even ask for more veins, but regardless, really, really cool to see that. You can actually request more veins. If, uh, Interests you a lot. It's a pretty big mask. Um, I have a mask called Junior. It's very similar, same concept, where it's like a baby face color. And I just really love this design that Jeff does. Um, there's another baby face color mask on his website called Little Angel. It's pretty much in, like close to the same vein, and I really want to. Um, get one eventually so he can fit with these other two guys but uh yeah that's the doll face mask really really cool and just like junior he has um a little bit more rolls on his neck gives him more character to the, the actual mask himself but uh yeah that's the baby face mask and after uh, I show you guys uh, these guys right here, I will be doing close-ups. Right here is the Bird as Hell mask. Just a really, really beautiful zombie mask. This guy, I think was released. Actually, I think he was released same time this mask over here, uh, Baby Taste was released. I could be wrong, but I remember seeing them together in a recent catalog. But yeah, he has a really generous size bib. You guys wear this in your costume, just tuck it in and you'll be fine. And uh, yeah, his face, his lips are gone. He's got uh, a wound right here, exposed. Muscle underneath. He's got some blood right here as well. He just, his skin's just not doing too well. And he's even got some more right here in the back of the head. More damage. Just, the detail is just absolutely amazing. And Jeff just always kills it. And I do like the color choice of his eyes. He has a, a light bluish eye right here. And it's the same deal with this eye, but there's just a little bit more red in there. And it just looks absolutely amazing. Do a quick 360 of the mask. scope of the mask. And I'll do a 360 of this guy as well. Baby face. This guy probably got me the most um, excited because just I was just blown away with the, how the paint job looked in person. It just looks really cool looking. So yeah guys, there you have it. There's the Death Studios mask. And I'll be doing close-ups and I'll also be wearing these guys in separate videos. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the videos and I'll catch you guys next time.